What about Daniel Cormier? What do you what do you think of when his name gets mentioned? Oh, uh, Daniel Cormier, man. Daniel Cor Daniel Cormier is our our current heavyweight champion of the world. Uh, he moved up to the heavyweight division because he lost to me twice at the light heavyweight division. Um, and uh, I think he's a great ambassador for mixed martial arts, man. He's a stand-up guy. He's always in a suit. He speaks very well. You know, I think a lot of people look at cage fighters as like these barbaric, crazy, tattooed up, you know, just wild boys, you know. And, and really, uh, there's a lot of men, a lot of gentlemen, a lot of college-educated men in, in, in the UFC, and Daniel's one of them. I'm grateful that he's our heavyweight champion, and, and if he ever wants a rematch against me, he can come back down to the light heavyweight division and lose again. So you won't go, <laughs> you won't go up to him. You won't go up to the heavyweight. You think about doing that? No, I won't. I won't. So, so I was the youngest, I was the youngest champion in UFC history, and I, I still hold that record. At age 23, I won my first title, and uh, I've won about 14 world titles since then. And uh, I've had the opportunity to go up to heavyweight and challenge many heavyweight champions over the years. And I never took the opportunity. Um, and now a lot of people really want to see me bump up and challenge Daniel Cormier, a guy that I've defeated twice. And I don't really know why him out of all the champions at heavyweight that there's been, that everyone wants to see me fight him at heavyweight. Um, I beat the guy twice, you know, first time by unanimous decision and second time by knockout. So I feel like I have nothing to prove. and. And things aren't really uh, things are going really good at the light heavyweight division. They say if it's not broke, don't fix it. So well, I mean, well, I, I I'll be a light heavyweight for a little while. I, I hear you, John. A lot of John Jones here on the Rich Eisen Show. There, there are some who may say, by the way, which is a way of somebody in my savvy position of saying something that uh, I'm not going to take ownership of, but just say other people are saying um, that uh, that you've you've run out of people to fight in the light heavyweight champ uh, division. Like, what what else is there for you to do? Um, yeah. in that weight class, John? Man, I think, I think you know, I've been hearing that a lot lately. Um, and I think, I think it's an insult to all the guys that are still at the light heavyweight division. There's a lot of young men um, that are coming up that I haven't faced yet. And uh, they're young, they're hungry, they're ambitious. They have a dream of, of having their life changed by winning a world title. And, uh, and I'm, I'm, uh, I'm the goal for a lot of these guys. I have a big target on my back. And to, uh, and to just leave the division when I'm small enough to make the division, um, I think I think it's doing all the, the young dreamers a, an injustice. I think I need to give them their chance to uh, at least compete against me and, uh, quite frankly, get their ass kicked. For more of The Rich Eisen Show, tune to Audience Channel 239 on DirecTV for free on BR Live or download The Rich Eisen Show app.